possible police pursuit on the city's south side last night ended in a crash that killed one person and sent nearly a dozen others on a CTA bus to the hospital. Our investigator Megan Hickey is digging into what happened and whether experts believe it was justified. While police aren't using the word chase, CPD says officers saw a car veering into oncoming traffic here near 68th and State. Then officers followed the speeding white Jeep about eight blocks to 60th and State. Where it slammed into another car and then this CTA bus. First responders reported one victim pinned inside a car. One of his cars pinned in to need an extract on it. He is pinned in. It's not looking good. The Cook County Medical Examiner's Office confirmed one person died, but the identification is still pending. Fortunately, no squad cars were involved in the crash, but 10 passengers on that CTA bus, including the operator, were transported to hospitals with non-life-threatening injuries. The consequences can be catastrophic to people who just happen to be on the same road, who are on an adjoining sidewalk, or even, as we saw in this case, on a bus. Policing expert David Harris tells us the fact that four guns were recovered from the car that turned out to be stolen is significant in the decision to follow the vehicle, but traffic offenses and theft of a car alone aren't enough, according to CPD's policy. The people or person in the fleeing car present some real danger. Um, they have to be wanted for a dangerous crime. Police radio traffic does not shed any light on those moments right before the crash when police started following the car. He said Chicago is one of many cities nationwide to recently add these caveats to its pursuit policies. Last year, the Community Commission on Public Safety and Accountability raised concerns that restrictions allow offenders to get away and contributed heavily to a citywide surge in robberies. Yes, we don't want bad guys to flee from the police, but... At the cost of civilian lives, not as clear. CPD's vehicle pursuit policy was revised in 2020 after a crash involving police killed a woman in Lakeview. CPD says they continue to investigate this scene here on the south side. Reporting in Washington Park, Megan Hickey, CBS News Chicago Investigators.